Hey tribe, <clears throat> what is the vibe? Welcome back to Born with a Bell Tarot. I'm Kay, and I'm here to do another reading for the collective. Holy Spirit, make me a clear channel. Please give me clear, concise, accurate messages for the collective. Archangel Michael, I ask that you protect me from anything that is not of the holiest white light. Anything that is not of the holiest white light, please do not allow it to come in. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. So I'm here to do another one for you guys because the last one I did got interrupted a few times. So I said, let me just do another one for you guys to be fair. All right. Um, <clears throat> I'd like to thank my subscribers. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. For those of you who've been rocking with me since below 50, I love and appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for the overall support to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video. And thank you for hitting that subscribe if you enjoy or resonate with the message. Remember, these are general messages, so take what fits, leave what doesn't. Also, a he may be a she and vice versa. <clears throat> and if I say something out of left field, it's just because I'm picking it up. So I'm going to drop it because it may resonate with someone. Okay. We got singing like a canary. Nobody ever really gave a damn about me until you came along. And then we got a piece of cake. <clears throat> so somebody could be spilling the beans here on something. You can't compete where you don't compare. Maggots don't go after rotten fruit. Hmm. So somebody is like. I don't know if somebody is, somebody could be talking about you collective, all right? It's like this person is realizing that you cared about them more than, I guess, anybody else. We have, they're going to talk regardless. Yeah, I feel like somebody, there's, obviously there's somebody that's trying to compete with you here, collective. Smiling faces tell lies. I'm trying to do the right thing for the kids. So for some of you collective, this person went back to their child's mother or child's father. Okay. But I'm feeling like with well, this maggots don't go after rotten fruit. It is, there's something here about your energy or, or somebody's energy here. It's like somebody's only trying to mess with you because of your energy, the type of energy that you carry, the type of energy that you embody. It's like this person, <clears throat> whoever this is, they, they, they talk a lot of shit. But they, they smile in your face. Or this is what this person is going through with somebody that smiles in their face. I only came back because I have nowhere to go. Mm. So this person could have left you and went to, to, to that person or something like that. Clean up on aisle three. Yeah, this is it's messy. It's a messy situation. Wherever this person is, it's a messy situation because it's like somebody could be holding something over somebody's head as far as like the fact that they, they don't have somewhere to go. I'm also hearing that somebody's child's mother could have let them back in, thinking that it was the right thing to do for the children. Shoulda, woulda, shoulda, coulda, woulda, but didn't. We had that come out in the last one. We had this one too. God bless the child that's got his own. Yeah, I feel like somebody here, whoever this person is, okay, I'm just feeling like this person, they go after people that they feel got it. Okay, but this person they use people. Okay, whoever, whoever it is, I'm picking up on this person uses people. Okay, and they smile up in their face, but it's like they talk shit behind their their back. <clears throat> At the bottom of the deck, we have early bird catches the worm. Hmm. 
So if somebody's coming back towards you, collective, that's only because they don't have anywhere to go. This person, their life is a mess right now. We got dusted off. Yeah, their life is a mess right now, but this person had opportunities to clean themselves up. They had, they had opportunities to clean up the situation, but they, they didn't. We got dirt digging, looking for dirt on you or vice versa. This person, they feel like it's going to be easy to get back with you here, okay? Because whoever they left for, this person cannot compete with you. We got dodging bullets. Yeah. So this person, whoever this, this person is, they got legal issues, okay? And they're trying to dodge whatever type of legal issues they have going on. So I'm picking up on somebody that's, they're going to come around and they're going to try to act like everything is cool. But this person is, they're running from something, okay? Same shit, different day. Yeah. With this person. It's always something with this person. I feel like this person comes off as the type of person that doesn't really have much going on, but they really, they got a lot going on beneath the surface. Fake, look, fake smiles. Yeah. Somebody is going to be smiling up in your face, but they, they just a whole fraud. Okay. What's this dusted off? Toil and labor reversed. So somebody is not struggling. This could be your energy collective. It's like you dusting off whatever issues this person. Okay, we got main female. So there's a karmic that's looking for some type of dirt on you or looking for some type of dirt on this person, okay? I feel like they're looking for some type of dirt or they have some type of dirt on this person and they're trying to use it on this person. It's this karmic that talks about you, okay? And this karmic talks about you, Collective, because they know deep down that you're better than them. They know deep down that whoever this person is cares way more about you than they ever did about them. And that's the problem. But the other problem is that whoever this person is that left you for this karmic, this person ain't shit either. For real. Okay? What's, what's this dodging bullets with this legal issues? So they got a, a, a bunch of problems going on over here with <clears throat> this karmic. We got message. Yeah, <clears throat> you might get a, a, some type of message here or this person got some type of message from the court. You might get a message from this person letting you know that they have some type of court situation going on. Okay. What's the same shit, different day? Hmm. Okay. We got pathway and poverty in reverse. So, I feel like this person is going through financial issues, okay, due to whatever kind of chaos they created in their life. It's like this person is stuck. Somebody's stuck here with this pathway reverse. Somebody's not able to move forward. Somebody's not able to have any progression here. And it's like somebody's wanting to come out of some type of poverty here. At the bottom of the deck, we got courthouse. Yeah, there's some type of court situation. Some type of court situation could be taking a hold of somebody's money. Yeah, and behind courthouse, we got courtship. So this could be some type of divorce situation that's happening. What's this? That's it all. Reunion. So whoever this person is, collective. 
this person is trying to this person is it's like they're struggling right now okay and it's like they want to come have some type of reunion here with you or somebody's wanting to have a reunion with your past person because they're struggling okay it's like this person whoever this karmic is they want to have a reunion with your person and whoever your person is it's like they want to have a reunion with you because they realize that whoever they chose over you cannot compare to you okay i feel like whoever this person chose is somebody that they thought was going to be easy with this piece of cake right but it wasn't it wasn't about love it was just about whatever they thought they could get from this person and with this magus don't go after rotten fruit it was like this this karmic targeted your person as well because they thought that they were going to get something from them so it's like they smiled up in their face you know and said whatever they felt they needed to say okay for some of you this person like i said got back with their child's parent and the child's parent came on to them and made it seem like they needed them around for the kids okay What's this dirt digging? Hope. Yeah. So this comic is hoping to find something here on this person. Okay? I feel like this, this comic could quite possibly be trying to get this person locked up. Yeah, we got Sorrow. Clarifying this dodging bullets with this yeah, this this whoever this person is, they're they're in regret for whatever they did with this karmic that got them into these legal problems now. Okay? They're like in deep regret. What's this same shit different day? We got thought and journey reverse. Everything over here is reversed except the same shit, different day. So somebody is not, it's like somebody can't think, somebody can't, somebody's stuck. Like I said, with this pathway reverse, it's like somebody's stuck. Journey reverse, somebody can't move. It's like somebody's stuck. They could be stuck in a situation with this person where it's nothing but drama every day. And I feel like this person is trying to get out. Then we got friend. So this could have something to do with a friend. This could be a friend for some of you that this person got with, okay? Somebody that knew you. What's this dusted off? Fury. Yeah, somebody's angry. This karmic is angry because she's struggling or he's struggling. I'm going to say she because we have the, the karmic feminine out here. Okay, this person is like, they're, they're angry because they're struggling. They're trying, to, they're trying not to like let things seem like it's, it's as bad as they are. But they're wanting to have a reunion with this person from your past. And they're angry Okay, this person is, this person, they're spitting fire. Let's just put it like that, okay? What's this dirt digging? Third wheel. Yeah, the karmic. This karmic. This, this person is hoping to, to, like I said, this is somebody that you know. This is somebody that was a friend of yours. This is somebody that you considered a friend at one point in time that was hating on your relationship. Like, that's it. Like, they saw how you and your person were together and they, they envied it, Okay. And now they're hoping to get this person back. But it was never meant to be in the first place. You, they can't compete when they don't compare. What's this um, dodging bullets? Bruh. 
blind. Yeah. This person didn't see what they were getting themselves into with this person. And now they're trying to dodge bullets. It's like this person is so regretful for messing with this person. It's like... It wasn't all... <laughs> I'm hearing... The pussy wasn't all that it was cracked up to be, okay? It wasn't worth all of this, all right? What is the same shit, different day? Curse. Somebody's stuck. Somebody's stuck. This person could have been doing spell work, okay? And all type of shit every day. Same shit, different day. To try to probably put you into some type of poverty here or to block your pathway or to mess with your psyche, okay? we I, This came out in the last reading, okay? This, this person wanted to stop your journey. This person probably also wanted to unalive you, okay? But it's like they cursed themselves. We got adventure. That's like the fool card in this deck. Yeah, and behind that, we have, like, prof the profession card, which is the magician card. So it's like this person made a foolish risk to do some type of magic here, okay? And now, somebody's stuck. Somebody's pathway is stuck. Whatever they were trying to do to you is, is happening to them, okay? What's this dusted off? Mm -hmm. We got the world card. And we got the Seven of Swords. So, excuse me. This, an end has been put to whatever deception this person has been doing. Okay. Um, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio energy here with the world card. But a cycle is complete. All right. Whatever this person was doing to deceive whoever. Yeah. They kept doing it. They kept, yes, they kept doing something. Look, this person was definitely doing some type of magic here or some type of something that they shouldn't have been doing. Okay? On the low. They kept sending some type of something your way. What's this dirt digging? Ace of Cups. Mm. Yeah. <sighs> mm -hmm. We got the Ace of Cups and the Nine of Swords. So I feel like somebody... It was real love here, okay, between you and your person. And whatever this person did to interrupt, now this person is in Nine of Swords energy. They're having sleepless nights, okay? It's like, because they know that there's, like, they can't compete where they don't compare. This person didn't really have any, any love for your person, okay? Yeah. They in anxiety because it's over. It's a done deal. It's a wrap. Okay? Scorpio energy. <clears throat> so it's like they're trying to find a way to get this person. Yeah, four swords. It's like this person is like... It's like they're trying to find a way to like disrupt any way of you two getting back together here. But I don't even think that you want this person back, Collector. Some of you may. But this person, whoever this person is, this third wheel, this karmic that, you know, came between you two. 
this person, it's like this person is needed to have love for self. This person doesn't love themselves either. And that's why it's such an issue for them. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah. It's over. This person is like, it's like they need, they're needing to leave behind whatever it is that they're doing because that still boils down to four swords. It's like they need to retreat from whatever it is that they're doing. <sighs> What's this? Um, Dodging bullets. We got the page of wands. And we got everything is fine. Yeah. Somebody's gonna, it's like somebody's going to come in. I don't know if this person is going to try to like tell you that they, everything is okay with them. But like I said, this person is in regret. They're in deep regret. Yeah. This person is needing some healing here with the star card, Aquarius energy. It's like this person got betrayed by whoever they left you for and now it's like they wanted to come back because they're sorry okay it's like they walked into this thing blind there could have been spell work here as well i would not doubt it okay but now this person is like it's like they want to want any kind of good news in their life they want some type of positivity here but it's like this person it's like they have a big ego so they're coming through with the ten of ten of swords but everything is fine so it's like this person, this this just gives me the energy of somebody that no matter what negative things happen to them, they bottle everything up. This person doesn't process the bad things that happen in their life. It's like they bottle everything up. So this person might have a tendency to blow up. Yeah, we got the magician in reverse. This person got with somebody that was manipulative. It's like they just want to have some type of healing after dealing with this type of person. Yeah, I feel like this person, they did a number on, on your past person collective, okay? What's this same shit, different day? This person was doing spell work over and over every day to try to put you into some type of poverty block your pathway, block your journey. They wanted to put a curse on you. They wanted to bring nothing but misfortune to you and that's what they brought on themselves. And now they're angry and struggling and wanting to reunite with this person. Yeah. They were passionate. Ace of Wands. They were passionate about whatever they were doing every day. Every day. It's like the, every day this person got up and the first thing they did was put some shit out in the air. Okay. with this early bird catches the worm yeah it's like like i said this person got up and the first thing they did was put down some type of spell work to try to get you stuck you were supposed to be the worm collective yeah seven of wands <laughs> oh my goodness mm -mm 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 -mm. This person was doing the most to attack you here, collective. The seven of wands. That's somebody that's challenging. That's somebody that's standing their ground as well. But it's also somebody that is um, attacking somebody. Yeah, four of cups. They, this person, ever since your person walked away from this person, they have been doing this. They probably were doing this while the person, your person was still with them. Just to get rid of you. Yeah. The devil. <laughs> this person was doing a bunch of devilish shit. Just because they were rejected. Capricorn energy here with the with the devil. Virgo, Gemini here with the magician. Okay. This person was doing the most. What's the outcome for this?
This person was also doing something online, something deceptive online. We got the King of Wands. The five of wands, the five of swords, and the three of wands. <sighs> so somebody here is okay. So the king of wands, that's somebody that's highly creative, right? That's somebody that's ambitious, okay? The king of wands is bold, he's charismatic. So Somebody is coming in here with this five of swords. Somebody's trying to win. It's like somebody's trying to win at all costs. Somebody is trying to have some type of unfair advantage here. This could be this, this, this is this karmic. Okay. I feel like this karmic operates a lot in masculine energy and your person, they operate in feminine energy. And I feel like whoever this karmic is that they got with this karmic, this karmic could be bigger than your person in size. Like, as far as, like, I feel like this person is just very masculine in how they carry themselves, this, this feminine, okay? And I feel like this masculine that's involved in this carries themselves in a more feminine energy, okay? But I feel like this, this, is, the, this is this karmic's energy. This person is still trying to take you down, okay? This this person is still trying to do whatever they're trying to do here. And they're waiting for the results. They're waiting. Whatever they're doing with this spell work, with this curse, it's like they're doing it and they're waiting for it to take hold. What else? Let me see what else we could get before we close out. What other um, messages for this spread? Holy Spirit. Into you. Hustling. Yeah. All this comic wants is money. And it's like they know that this... They're angry because they know that whoever your person is... Is it's like the product, the the chemistry you have with this person is everything, and they hate that. That's why they tried to get in between in the first place. But it was like it wasn't real, so they couldn't get your person to feel about them the way they feel about you. But this person, it was never about love anyway. It was always about money. It was always about hustling this person because whoever your person is, they could they could have like a decent job or, you know, they they could just be financially. Um, stable. Okay. Shine. Yeah, your light irritates their demons. This person is mad at you because they can't be you. That's all it boils down to. Okay. They can't compete where they don't compare. Yeah. Kissing ass. They kissing your person ass and your person is coming to kiss your ass. Okay. Possibly with this eight of wands here, this person could have a motorcycle for some of you. Yeah, fed up. This person is fed up with this karmic. This karmic ain't shit. Okay? This person is like, they, they feel like they plagued themselves. Okay? Moving on, yeah. <laughs> This person feels like they played themselves for what? You know what I'm saying? Let me get a few more. They moving on. It's like, no thank you. Yeah, <laughs> uninterested. This person is moving on, they're done. And this karmic is upset and taking it out on you. Yeah. Scarcity tactics. Yep. It's like, mm, 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 mm. this person needs attention. Whoever this karmic is, this person, it's like, they didn't get a lot of attention when they were a child or something. Okay. Bankrupt. Yeah. 
They are everything they wanted for you. They're going through it. Goopy. This person only goes after people that they feel like has money or a certain type of status. All right, let me get a few more and then that's it. Haunted. Yep. Comic friends. This person is a friend of yours or was a friend of yours or fake friend of yours, okay, collector? But now they're haunted and they're having all the side effects of all the things that they've been doing to somebody that is quite possibly a chosen one or just anointed, okay? A earth angel, possibly, okay? Now everything they try to do to you is happening to them. They're stuck. But I'm going to leave it here, guys. If you resonate with this, I hope it gave you some insight. If it did... Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Love you. Later.